Yeah, he is. Then in the book of Ruth, he's the kinsman redeemer. Yeah, he's the kinsman redeemer. In first and second Samuel, we see him in the sufferings and the rejections of the enthronement of David. Because before Jesus became Lord, he was rejected. He suffered. So in the, in the sufferings and rejection of David, there was a symbolic communication of how Christ will be rejected and he will suffer and he will die and he will rise and glory will follow. That's in first and second Samuel. Are you still here? First and second Samuel. In, in the book of first and second Kings, we see Jesus as the redeemer than Solomon. And we see Jesus as the greater than the temple. In Matthew eleven forty two, 42, Jesus talked about one that is greater than the temple. Matthew eleven forty two 42 to 46, put it up for me. Matthew, Jesus answered and said, Matthew eleven forty two. Matthew eleven forty two. Okay, because of time. So Jesus said there is one greater than the temple in this place. Because when we see in the books, we see the glory of the kings. The glory of the kings of Israel. Of which we see Jesus having a greater glory and dominion than the kings of Israel. So their, their royalty was symbolic of the reign of Christ. 